What's up, Life is a Mission Roving Team? Welcome back to Life is a Mission TV Roving Team, people. Well, 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 well. It's a sigh of relief for many Jamaicans. Well, people might say it's a minority. You understand? And they might say it's not a sigh of relief for society. But it's a sigh of relief for many, many people. Especially, you know, people who support Vibes Cartel. People, the news is out. Vibes Cartel is free. The court of appeal has freed Vibes Cartel of his conviction and his co-accused. Um, most information are still sketchy at this time. So... In subsequent new newscasts and stuff like that, I will bring you more. But what I can tell you right now, my people, Vibes Cartel is free. I will bring you a few, uh, a clipping of his lawyer speaking at the end of this. So in the meantime, Life is a Mission TV people, supporters, please go and hit the thumbs up now. Please to watch the ads, continue to support the channel. As I said today, is the last day of the month where I'm asking you people to give me three make I reach that 3,000 subscription for the end of this month and there's an extension about it where I won't visit my channel until to see if I have reached until probably sometime 12 o'clock tomorrow so basically for some of you people who might never find the time to jump on the channel to hear I'm asking for this few subscription to reach a margin of 3,000 subscription on the channel um, you will get a little more time to do so so please I am asking you let me wait tomorrow in the emancipation day and see the channel is at 3,000 subscribers this video is all about just to let you know long awaited you know lot of stress lie both set of liars both accused both you know, defendant, prosecutors, jury, lawyers, you know, judge, because even the, 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 the lawyers are probably exhausted, despite people might say they are getting paid, but for a long drawn out case like this, and remember, they said this is one of the, a case, this is a case that make history. It is one of the longest trial ever, right? So you just judge that, and not to mention after getting convicted have to go back to the privy council and stuff like that and you know even for this person it is supposed to be frustrated but basically when you hear posts of him and stuff you know he's very optimistic of being free of all charges once him get the privilege by the the privy council you know that the, the appeal court in Jamaica should make a decision. The final decision is either give him a retrial or, you know, to overturn the conviction. He was always optimistic, he and his lawyers. And, you know, people, honestly, to me, I am not here to say if he does it or he don't. What was my main concern in this case is, you know, there was too much you know where evidence is concerned there was too much playing around with evidence and from day one when i hear that this case is going to the privy council and come out of the hands of the local judiciary i was optimistic myself that he stands a very great chance because remember now we you know the privy council as they state to the local authority the dpp and her set of people that she don't matter what this this gentleman do of the past leading up to what he has been convicted for they don't matter what is out there otherwise what they are dealing with is the present situation of a fair trial of his conviction presently and there were specific things that was talked about and stuff like that and knowing that it is going to the Privy Council, oh, you'd say neutral. No matter who name this or name around this, so which big man up there so can call this a small man or that the big man or call that the man there. It's nothing about that. 
it's neutral right you just want the defendant to come and put a proper case to the privy council and once they come and put a proper case to the privy council with all the anky panky that has been said where evidence is concerned and tampered and this and that and tar and that yeah i'm kind of optimistic that he's going to be free by the privy council only that the privy council did send back to make them make the decision because probably they were kind of you know but even when him come back despite the local appeal did turn down his appeal at first the court of appeal you know i was saying why the privy council send it back to somebody who already turned it down better than it just make the ruling either it stay or them let him go but when all have said and done and that was the case that he have to come back here i did just feel like yes and then you know the judiciary come under pressure where financial who's and all those things is concerned so you know as i say the gaza fans are happy uh i just come back in off of the road after i go pick up my daughter um my big daughter book as you know here, I said she have a little delay in her medical with a COVID test. It finally and book release and I get it. Yes, two of them have them immigrant visa now. And I also completed the final leg of meeting that woman. Finally see her today. You know, the lady on the stoplight that I was wa I wanted to give back something to. And I just reach in and my kid's grandmother called me and tell me that, okay, XYZ, because I sent her a message that, okay, the book has been picked up. And she let me know Vibes Cartel free, so I jump on Instagram, bam, 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 say a few things. Now I have no time to really do anything or do any whole heap or something, but just to post a video here. So further details might come tomorrow. So just stay tuned and hear this little clipping of his lawyer. But for all of the Gaza fans, them, Vibes Cartel is free. Not meaning that he has leave from the correctional because you know there's a process now signing over documents and release and stuff like that but the lawyers the la you're going to hear the lawyer say all of that is in process immediately so it might take a few days how long i can't say all right so stay tuned for the lawyer clipping and one of our main news station i want to thank the team mr clark mr beach mr Chevrolet, and myself for the hard work that we put it was a long fight, many years, many things came from it, but we are now um, here awaiting the release of Adija Palmer. <laughs> what time the cartel be free? Um, that's how it, that, 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 has, that has to happen. Process the, process start, the process has started and, and we would hope today because the constitution says something about no, that. No, the judge says that he's free. The judge says he's so free. So the question now, yes. yeah, the yeah, must explain. Why is a female in the custody? So they have to do what they'll have to do. But he's free. So what? Yeah, the judge. After the usual process.